to sport now and Glenelg coach Mark Micken admits there are huge expectations on his team to win Sunday's SANFL Grand Final against Central District. It's a Tigers first Grand Final in 16 years and the Bulldogs ninth in a row. Mark Micken says his team is well aware of the pressure on his club. There's an expectation from within the playing group that we really perform on the day. You know, it's, you know the, the playing group made it very clear that they're not just there to play in a, a grand final and get a thrill out of it. The Bulldogs are taking a familiar road to the grand final and look relaxed today as they prepared for a shot at their seventh premiership. There's no second prize with this. Um, and we like to think over the last seven, eight weeks, we've been a club on the improve a bit after a pretty ordinary season. So you know, we'd like to come out and think on the weekend we can improve again. You know, I still reckon out of our second semi and playing Glenelg, we've got some areas that we can address, that we can try and improve on. And you know, if we can get better at those areas, we think we can be really competitive. The Dogs are quietly confident their track record in finals will see them through. We need to know what it uh, takes to, I guess, win a grand final. But, uh, you know, we've had enough blokes that have, uh, in the team that have experienced the other side and we know that, you know, that's something we don't want to experience. Playing on Football Park will be a new experience for many of the Tigers, but captain Ben Mules doesn't think it will be a factor. I suppose you'll find out on Sunday, but, um, yeah, not many uh, players have played out here, but, you know, it's just sort of, you know, we've played on a lot of footy grounds before. I don't think this will be any different. Some rain is predicted for Sunday, but the players say the conditions won't affect either side. Earlier today, Adelaide and Eagles...